Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and this is a question that has come through uh, since we talked about Windows updates and Windows 10 and Windows 11, um, and the fact that in Windows 10 updates are going to be much smaller and install faster uh, for most cases. Uh, the question was, if I don't install um, the optional updates um, that arrive at the end of the month, is it, does it take longer for the Patch Tuesday updates to install? Um, and also, at the same time, we can answer the famous question that was there yesterday. How are they optional if they are installed with Patch Tuesday? And yeah, technically, it's not an optional update. The optional word comes from the fact that when you get your updates at the end of the month, they are not you don't have to install them. They're not mandatory. So that's why they call them optional, but they're not really optional. Since they are cumulative updates, they must add up to install the next updates. So yes, they are optional at the end of the month, but they become mandatory when you install Patch Tuesday. So it's not a real optional. It's optional for a short amount of time. As for the install time of updates, yes, if you do install the Patch Tuesday updates and you have not installed the bug fixing updates the previous month, that adds up to more installs that needs to be done, more updates. And so, yes, it makes the Patch Tuesday update longer. So by doing the uh, optional bug fixes, you, in fact, are making the Patch Tuesday security updates faster to install because it doesn't have to install those updates at the same time. So that is uh, unfortunately uh, true that if you ignore them, it makes every Patch Tuesday a little longer uh, to uh, install the same updates. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.